Okay, so we've played a few holes now. Um, before I kind of get into what I what I noticed and everything, I just want to kind of hear from you what um, kind of what your thought process was the first few holes that we played. Um, you know, just kind of you know, just, just kind of give me a rundown of what, what you felt was good, not so good. We'll kind of go from there. Well, I felt like the swing felt good, but it's really quick just because of the ball flight and everything kind of tended to go a little left. Okay. But getting up and down has been better than I thought. It's just kind of getting two degrees out of the tee right now, I think. Which is kind of usually when I can't figure out my swing, especially on the tee box, I try to slow everything down. I try to think a little bit more. Try to take my time a little bit more in the setup. And what, okay, what, what exactly, when you say think, what are you thinking about? I'm thinking about just like. I don't really like to try to fight what I'm doing on the golf course. I try to just play it. But okay. when it's an unplayable shot, you know, like a, a dead hook or a, a 90 degree cut, I try to minimi minimize it just a little bit. So okay. I try to just, I usually think about just staying in the plane and keep my hands to the ball. Okay, so we got like a swing, kind of a swing thought that we're Yeah. Doing. Okay. All right, good. Um, yeah, I would say, you know, today, you know, you said before they were you know, two-way miss is kind of the thing that you're fighting with. Today, we're not, we, you know, our miss right now is, has been left off the tee, yep. left and left. So, you know, with that being said, I know we're struggling there. You're still keeping a good, you know, as far as a mental approach, you're still staying positive. I just haven't really seen you get, get down on yourself. Yeah. Um, when you do get yourself in those bad positions off the tee, you're doing a good job of not, you know, worsening that. You're, yeah. you're punching out, getting the ball back into play. Mm -hmm. Um, from there, you know, I would say you might get a little too aggressive on that next shot in. Yeah. Um, where I'd like to see you kind of get to a, put yourself in a position for the, the third or fourth shot even. Now, instead of making it worse by trying to hit a three wood 230 yards to the green, like on the last hole. Yeah. Um, really put ourselves in more of a better position where you're going to have a club that you're comfortable with okay. as opposed to like a short little 60 yard half 56 or whatever yeah. that sometimes you say can, you, you, you might struggle on a little bit um, other than that we are fighting that that left miss right now yeah um, as far as your pre-shot routine <laughs> Do some editing on that. I know. <laughs> right, hopefully, it doesn't fall over again. Uh, so, in, in addition to that, as far as your pre shot routine, one thing that I, I do notice is the first thing that you do is you go right up to the side of the golf ball and start doing your practice swing. Mm -hmm. Then you do take a little step back, and it's rather quick, and you just kind of look down and go. Yeah. I like to see you try actually, uh, you know, take your practice swings and everything from directly behind the golf ball. Okay. Uh, and then really visualize what you're going to do. You told me on the opening tee shot you like to visualize, you know, a field goal yep. and try to knock it through there. Um, so really, you know, stand behind the golf ball more. Find your find your exact target. Maybe take your you know, visualize the shot you want to hit. Right now we're hitting a little bit left. Mm -hmm. So we might want to, you know, we definitely don't want to aim down the right side because if we hit the ball straight or we do have that little fade. Yeah. Where you want, but really, really focus on your target. And in addition to that, try not to really think too much about keeping it on plane. Mm -hmm. Everything, because you already, you're, you're a 1.4 handicap. You're, yeah. Your swing is good. Like yeah. You're going to be on plane. Let's try to focus more on the target. Okay. And then, and just kind of try to swing to that. When you take your practice swing, try to feel the shot that you want to hit. Okay. If you want to hit that fade, try to feel that. Okay. Um, but let's do a better job just on your pre-shot routine of standing behind the golf ball, take maybe one or two practice swings, and then and then get up and get up and go. Yeah. All right. Perfect. All right. <laughs>